So are you ready to get ready for your last day of school or what? If you had said that speaker any louder I wouldn't have been alive to get ready for school. Well Dora, that's your own fault for sleeping in. Is that right? I didn't realize that sleeping in until 7 a.m. on the last day of school was considered a crime. Besides, I stayed up late last night studying for my final exams. Sleeping in until 7 o'clock a.m. on your last day of school shows a lack of responsibility Dora. And forgive me if I find it hard to believe that you were studying all night. I don't need your beliefs mom. I know how hard I worked. And for your information, my grades have been consistently good this year. News flash Dora, a D- isn't a consistently good grade. Also, it's just gonna go downhill from here if you continue to be late. I wouldn't have been late even if I woke up at 7.30. And besides, it's not like I'm going to miss anything important. We're just going to watch some movies and have a party. That's literally all we do on the last day. You might not think it's important, Dora, but it's still your responsibility to show up on time. And if you don't start taking your education seriously, you're going to regret it in the future. I honestly couldn't care less about my education. Well I do, and I'm your mother, so, get ready for school right now. Whatever, just let me grab my backpack and we can go. No, we don't have time. You should have been ready already. We're leaving now. If I get in deep crap because my teacher noticed I didn't have a backpack, it's on you. Yeah yeah sure, I don't care, just get in the car. Okay, let's go. Well I guess it's time to go in. Late again, huh Dora? You know, you're becoming the bane of my existence. I don't think missing the first 10 minutes of a movie is going to ruin my chances of passing. It won't, but you still need to be on time, whether I'm playing a movie or not. And why don't you have a backpack? Long story. I don't want to hear it, just sit down. Okay, well, now that everyone's here, I'd like to hand out your final report cards. What the hell Ms. Martin? I got all F's on literally every subject. I couldn't have sucked that hard, couldn't I? Well Dora, you couldn't have sucked that hard, had you just shown up for class on time, instead of arriving an hour late every day. Well, thanks to you, I won't be graduating this year. You will, it'll just be a little bit different. Oh, and how is that? Guess what? You have to go to summer school. Oh no, I can't go to summer school not after all this time I spent in this hellhole. I can't oh 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 Get a grip Dora, it's not that big a deal. It is big a deal, I had plans this summer, and now I can't graduate unless I miss them. That's too bad, now get out of my classroom, I'm done arguing. Stupid Miss Martin, giving me all Fs. Mom is gonna kill me if she sees this. Maybe it's best if I didn't show her. Hey! 
Hay is for horses. Now leave me alone. Not so fast, young lady. I need to see your report, and I need to see it now. Oh, I got straight A's. No need for me to show you. Oh, really? Want me to tell you how I know that's bull crap? How? I just got an email from your teacher, and she told me that your grades were, and I quote, less than average, to put it politely. Okay, okay, fine. Here's my report card. What happened to the D minus you were apparently getting? I swear, Ms. Martin just gave me all F's because she hates me, and no other reason. Wanna know what's worse? She said I have to do summer school if I want to graduate middle school. You are grounded, 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 grounded for any number that pops into my head to the power of 69 times 420 generations and correct after that. Go to your room now.